Hi, I'm Sean Yannon, this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about literal equations. We're going to solve each equation for the indicated variable. So if I was given this equation, g equals x minus c plus y, and we're solving that for x. Okay? Well, we need to solve for x, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to rewrite my equation. g equals x minus c plus y, and we can probably do all this in one step, so let's go for it. I'm going to add a c to both sides, and I'm going to subtract a y to both sides individually. That leaves me, well, these cancel, leaving with an x on the right, and then I just have, well, g plus c minus y here on the left. Pretty simple, right? All I need to do now is I'm going to rewrite that x comes first, because that looks nicer. The rest is already isolated, or x is isolated, and the rest is just there, we can't combine them. So you have g plus c here minus y, and then we're done. No like terms can't combine the g to the plus c minus y, and there we go. So our final answer just being x equals g plus c minus y. So let's recap. We're given g equals x minus c plus y, and we're solving for x. So I rewrote my equation, and I decided to do all this in one step. I added a c to both sides and eliminated the minus c on the right. Added, I subtracted a y to both sides and eliminated the plus y on the right. That left me with an x on the right, and then I, on the left-hand side, Nothing can combine, so we just kind of wrote it all out here. G plus C minus Y. That equaled by X. And then I rewrote this. I have X come first, right? Because that looks nicer. And so our final answer here is X equals G plus C minus Y. 